Hello Capricorn, this is your reading for the 15th through the 16th. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. We have passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. Beautiful. Soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. Hmm. And give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. Beautiful. Okay, you guys are the first ones to get these cards today. Hmm. Good things going on here, I feel, for you guys. Passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. This is the one. It just takes a little effort. Let's see. The Empress. Oh, yeah. Feeling very confident. I feel very independent. Um, Self-assured. Do not need anyone else to make you feel good because you got it. All right? You got it. And the Hierophant. Hmm. I think a lot of you are a little too comfortable right now, though. You know, it's like, um, hmm. I feel like there's like a Taurus individual that um, may be significant to you guys that maybe has um, shied away from you, you know. But I feel that this person is just being stubborn at this moment. But this is definitely your person, whether you want to believe it or not, okay? Then we have the high priestess. You know this. They know it too. They know it. So if you guys are not talking to this person, if you're not with this person, regardless, they know it and you know it. Okay? You guys probably are not speaking right now. They probably come across as um, a little secretive, mysterious, kind of aloof. Um, but I definitely get that both of you are in the knowing, okay? Hmm. Somebody wants to start over again. Somebody wants to bring back that spark that you guys once had. Definitely passionate about you guys here. Somebody wants to tell you that. I'm feeling that strongly. Hmm. Yeah. This is this is somebody who I feel like you guys uh, there was an ending of a relationship here with someone and I I'm feeling like it had to end so you guys could go your separate ways and kind of learn about yourself on your own away from each other because when you were in it it just really is like you guys were bumping heads because the two of you are so very strong and so there is a need for you guys to separate and kind of go your separate ways and learn about each other i feel like the other person um, more so to follow their intuition and their heart and not be so stubborn and set in their ways and for you to be able to open up and and express yourself the way that you need to is what i'm getting here okay but this person is definitely um oh okay look at that flipped out the lovers there mm-hmm um this person definitely knows that you are the one they know that you guys have a very strong connection they know that you are their soulmate you know that they are yours and um there was a choice here um to end it and probably on the other person's part Okay. Hmm. Five of Wands there. There was a lot of conflict. I feel like this person was conflicted too over whether or not to like end this relationship and go out on their own because I'm feeling like this person is very stubborn. Okay. But now this person wants to come out of conflict. They no longer have a question in their mind about whether or not they want to be with you. Um, this person wants to start over with you. Most definitely. They want to start over with you. Hmm. I feel like they, they're a changed person. They're not so stubborn anymore. They're not so unmoving anymore, okay? 
Oh yeah. <laughs> so now they're they're transforming here um, from the Hierophant, like really being stubborn and set in their ways, and you know not want to take any action, to the King of Wands, you know, <laughs> wanting to get into it. Want to want to get back into the flow of things, into this relationship, starting over again, coming to you, telling you how passionate they are about you. Before they were very unsure, though. They were very unsure about it. Okay. Very unsure about it. Hmm. I think you kind of confused them. <laughs> But now they want to work with you guys. They definitely want to work with you. They want to give you what they didn't give you before. Okay. And they have thought long and hard about this. Long and hard about this. And they're not sure if you're willing to accept them at this point. Okay. They're not sure if you want to rebuild this thing. Mm -mm. They're thinking that you guys are done. Because they know that they did not give you what you needed. Okay. And what you needed, I feel like, was commitment. And you know your worth. But guess what? Now they do too. Alright? So we have Capricorn, which is you. We have um, Gemini, Taurus, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energies here. Um, Scorpio, Pisces, Libra may be here. Aquarius is here. Um, I feel, yeah. Okay, let's see what we have. We have the divine, the divine physician, Archangel Raphael. It says, "Thank you, Raphael, for shining your divine light upon my healthy body." Hmm. And I feel like this is all about you know giving awareness. To be honest with you, um, bringing back that spark, bringing back the excitement inside, okay, where and, and the light that was, you know, had kind of gotten a little dim. But I think now there's like an invigoration in this person, this individual, where they once seemed pretty lackluster to you guys, okay, like they had just removed themselves, like. You know, the passion was gone. Maybe there was some unrequited love here at one point. But now, it's like um, something has been lit in this situation once again, guys. Alright, so that's what I have for you. And I will be speaking with you guys soon.